Welcome to the FishPod 10BX Tech Tutorial, the Bluetooth boat mount fish finder that turns your phone or tablet into a powerful fish finding sonar device. Let's start by opening the package. Inside the box, you'll find the depth sounder module, referred to as the DSM in this video, a quick launch guide, support documentation, a transom mount transducer with an integrated plug and play connector and mounting hardware, and two water resistant connectors with harnesses. If anything is missing, please reach out to us through our support portal. The first step in setting up your FishPod 10BX is to install the DSM and transducer. To install the transducer, either follow the link in the video description or search our support portal for instructions on installing a transom mount transducer. If your boat requires a through-hole transducer, additional guidance is available in our support portal by searching for transducer exchange program. To install the DSM, start by selecting a location near a switchable 12 volt power source. Secure the DSM using the provided stainless steel mounting screws. Next, connect the two watertight connectors. The left connector is for the 12 volt power supply and the transducer, while the right connector is for connecting to an NMEA network. This NMEA connector is intended for advanced users and will not be needed. Secure this harness with a zip tie to keep it out of the way. Connect the red wire to the positive terminal of a switchable 12 volt power source and the black wire to the negative terminal. Next, plug the transducer cable, which you routed during installation, into the transducer connector on the DSM. To test the DSM, turn on the external power source and observe the light on top. A blinking red light indicates the unit is powered on but not receiving sonar data. A blinking green light indicates the unit is receiving sonar data and is ready to connect to the app. Please note, the boat must be in the water for the green light to blink. Next, let's download the app from the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store by scanning the QR code in the Quick Launch Guide. You can also find the app on the iOS or Google Play App Stores and search for the app by entering FishPod into the store's search tool. Once downloaded, open the app, read the notices and agree to each of them. The app will now go into search mode to find your FishPod. If you're demoing the app, tap skip, you can pair your new fish pod later. To connect to your fish pod to the DSM, turn on the external power source and verify the light is blinking. Once the fish pod is found, tap it and you'll be ready to go. You can verify that the device is connected by looking at the Bluetooth symbol on the top right hand side of the screen. A black symbol means it's connected, a red X through the symbol means the app is not connected to a fish pod. Tap the Bluetooth icon at any time to access your device list where you can select previously paired devices or other available devices that you can pair. It's important to note that the fish pod will only provide accurate readings when your vessel is in the water with at least 2.5 feet of water beneath the transducer. You can confirm this by checking for the green blinking light on the DSM. Before we continue let's put the fish pod into simulation mode by tapping the fish pod icon on the top left of the screen then tap mode and then simulator on the bottom left of the screen. Let's take a quick look at the main screen. On the top left you'll find the menu by tapping the fish pod icon. Under the fish pod icon you will find the water depth and temperature. Under the Bluetooth icon you'll see the depth scale. You can remove the depth scale in the settings menu. Whether you're a beginner, intermediate, or advanced fisherman, the FishPod 10BX only takes one touch to set up to your skill level. To access the preset modes, tap the FishPod icon at the top left, then tap mode. The VertuView mode is for beginner anglers looking for easy to understand bottom contour and fish readings. It detects fish as a series of icons and fills the bottom solid to clearly show structure and contour. The fish scape mode is for intermediate anglers looking for advanced features to pinpoint optimal fish habitats. It uses Hawkeye's fish target technology to show the location and depth of fish echoes, while delivering real-time sonar echoes to uncover debris, weed, trees, drop-offs and a variety of other valuable sonar data. The fish scape HD mode is for experienced anglers who demand a high-definition fishing experience. This mode identifies the depth, presence of fish with fish arch enhancement, bottom contour and composition, all on your device's HD color display. What you'll experience is a full screen of raw sonar. Unlike any other wireless sonar device, Fishscape HD sets you free by giving you an overabundance of sonar data, allowing you to use your fishing experience to perfectly target prey. The data mode displays the water depth and temperature and vessel speed and heading in a large easy-to-read format that can be viewed from several feet away while allowing the fish finder to run in the background so that you can keep an eye out for optimal fish habitats. 
The FishPod app has tons of useful adjustments to fine-tune your fishing experience. To make custom setup easy, we've added explanations for each setting in the app. Let's take a look. Tap the FishPod icon at the top left side of the screen, then tap Settings. Now, let's tap Sonar to access the Sonar-related settings. By tapping any of the menu items you will see a full explanation of what the settings do. Take some time to get to know the settings now, so you are ready to go when you hit the water. So that you can make on-the-fly adjustments we've conveniently added the fish echo, bottom scan, range, and alarm settings on the main menu. One of our favorite settings is the custom color palette. Check it out by tapping display in the settings menu, then tap color scheme. Here you can use the color palette to select any color scheme you desire. You can also activate the underwater virtue view setting where you'll get a multi-dimensional view of the underwater environment. Visit our support site for tips and tricks or reach out to us with any questions or comments that can help us to make your user experience even better. Thanks for spending the last few minutes with us. Now, it's time to hit the water and start fishing.